darlings before i start the cooking process let me quickly show you guys how i got the animal proteins that i used in cooking this our river state equiwe egwisi party soup <laughs> okay my darling so this is the market where i got the ingredients okay now guys i must say this in this our river state um equiwe egwisi soup we use cow meat i mean roasted cow meat in preparing it okay but the price i was told for the cow meat i you know picked up was very very on the high side for the, for that size so i had to change my mind and i got um goat meat instead and i got this leg of goat meat for 7000 naira okay which made sense to me even if things are really really on the high side now the cow meat i was told um 10000 naira and it looked small <laughs> for that amount so that's why i ended up getting the goat meat okay so next i got a parma cord this is a parma cord um stockfish head okay and i got this for a thousand five hundred so the next um protein i got is this fish which is popularly known as boar fish in river state <laughs> i mean anyone who is from river state should know this fish okay so guys um keep watching and while you watch um i'll definitely show you guys all the ingredients that i used in preparing this soup okay so my darlings, all I did here was spice up the goat meat with the onions, crayfish and fresh pepper that I pounded together, okay? And then I added seasoning cubes and salt before mixing. Guys, I mixed and mixed and mixed. In fact, I stirred and stirred and stirred, <laughs> okay? Just so I would get everything together. My darlings, if you do this like this before roasting the goat meat, oh my god, the flavor is amazing okay my darlings please do enjoy watching this video and while you watch do not forget to encourage me by liking the video okay it goes a long way in helping my channel grow <laughs> okay Now these are all the ingredients that I used in cooking this our lovely Ikwere Egwisi party soup. Okay, you just saw grinded okazi and um, grinded egwisi. Then this is the boar fish I showed you guys I got in the market and um, a palmer called stockfish. Okay, the next ingredient is isam, which is periwinkle. <laughs> we love periwinkle. Okay, we add it in practically almost all the soups that we cook here in river state okay so this is the dried goat meat just are basically everything guys so to cook this soup i started you know by frying the oil first i mean letting the oil get hot before frying the pepper crayfish and onions i pounded together earlier run okay now after frying for a few seconds i added the egwisi grinded egwisi which is actually the main main ingredient for making the soup okay guys now one of the things i always say whenever i'm posting a greasy soup is this 
to make a lump less greasy soup you have to stir and stir it takes a lot of stirring to dissolve the greasy properly okay so after stirring for a while i added water okay and covered up the soup to you know prepare or prep other ingredients <laughs> So what you see me adding here is seasoning cubes, okay? So after adding seasoning cubes, I also added salt for taste, okay? And I stirred and stirred and stirred again. <laughs> okay, thereafter, you know, I went ahead to prep the boar fish. My darlings, the cooking continues. <laughs> so after a few minutes of the soup boiling, I added the Apama stockfish head. I mean, I soaked it for a while, so at this time it was very soft, okay? So next, I added the boar fish to the soup as well, and then I covered up the soup to continue cooking. guys aside the fact that a greasy chicken's soup on its own but in this particular equerry a greasy party soup we also add offo which is another soup thickener okay offo adds its own texture aroma and taste to the soup okay my darlings now after adding the offo i had to stir the soup one more time at this point my darlings the soup was almost ready okay now the second to the last thing i added to this soup is the grinded okazi my darlings i must say this i actually grinded this okazi with crayfish okay to give it its own aroma <laughs> okay now after adding the okazi the very last thing i added was periwinkle but my darlings this my christmas cap is very important to me so i just had to wear it again <laughs> I mean, it's my signature cap for this vlog mask, okay? So my darlings, I added the okazi to the soup and um, thereafter, like I mentioned um, earlier, I added periwinkle, which was actually the very last thing I added to the soup before bringing the soup down. My darlings, now take a good look at this equerry party a greasy soup. Oh la la! <laughs> it is rich in texture, aroma, and taste. 
Now my darlings, I have obviously come to the end of today's Vlogmas video and I hope you enjoyed watching. <laughs> to my new viewers, please do not forget to tap on the subscribe button and join the family. Thank you guys. See you tomorrow in Vlogmas Day 24.